The Montana Grizzlies and the Idaho Vandals have been playing football against each other since 1903. Today they renew the rivalry for the 88th time here in Missoula and a real treat for fans, a battle of two unbeaten Big Sky teams here in Missoula. Johnson drops straight back, has a man in the end zone. Did he catch it? What a junior Bergen! And that's a touchdown for the Montana Grizzlies! He shoots and goes and gets the quarterback. Uh-oh, Roback has problems with the snap. He's in the end zone. It's going to be a safety. We've seen a couple safeties in the early going of the last uh, couple games. Crazy things have happened to the Grizz special teams. McCoy is 10 of 14 in passing for 126 yards. That's Cummings in motion. Pass over the middle. That's picked off. And That's off Patrick to the races is Patrick O'Connell. To the to the 20, down to the 15. So there goes their turnovers. They hadn't had a turnover in Big Sky play till now. Guess what? Patrick O'Connell. They were plus eight in the turnover ratio. That is going to be uh, one of the main situations here in this game. Whoever wins the turnover battle may end up winning the football game. Great play by O'Connell to drop back into the pattern and McCoy simply didn't see him on the Brett's RV replay. What a return by O'Connell. Here we go. Johnson on the sneak. Now he's in the end zone, and that's a touchdown for the Montana Grizzlies. Yeah, the Grizz line. And then you combine that with Lucas Johnson's size and strength. Why wouldn't you just sneak it right there? Let's see how the Grizzly defense picks up this play. Here comes O'Connell. Throw wide open. Hayden Hatton in the end zone for the touchdown for the Idaho Vandals. Oh, blown a turn of events here right before halftime. They faked a wide receiver screen and had the inside man go on a go route. And Idaho sets up at the 43 yards already inside Grizzly territory. McCoy back to pass. He unloads it deep, wide open, and a touchdown. Is that Hayden Hatton again? I believe it is. That was man-to-man -man coverage. Corbin Walker had the man-to-man -man coverage. The ball was slightly underthrown, back shoulder type of pass on a post route, and just an excellent job of adjusting to the ball. Montana likely will win the game with a touchdown and a, and a PAT. Pick oh, it's again. picked again. He intended it for Mitch Roberts, alone in the, into the end zone at the five. Always oh, close. Didn't get the number yet. Number 19 for the Vandals. Step right in. Davis Denga. Behind McCoy with the two extra blockers. The give is to Johnson, and he's in the end zone for the score. And that's the Idaho Vandals tacking on big points here in the final two minutes of the fourth quarter. Go up by 14 if possible. McCoy will keep it himself. Fakes the run, and he's going to just waltz into the end zone for the successful two-point conversion, putting the Grizzlies down two scores. Number one versus number two in the FCS. Here's Lucas Johnson, fakes the pitch. Looking for anybody open is Mitch Roberts. He's into the end zone, and the Grizzlies score the touchdown with 32 seconds left. Lucas Johnson to Mitch Roberts. The Idaho Vandals come into Washington Grizzly Stadium and are leaving with the little brown stein in hand their first time to take that over low low pass back to moscow idaho since 1999. well for marty morningway kyle hansen john stepanik in the booth i'm jay cone for our entire mtn crew good afternoon from missoula where the idaho vandals defeat the grizzlies 30 to 23 year final our next broadcast october 19th when the grizzlies travel to weaver state to take on the wildcats Thank you for watching Big Sky Conference Football here on MTN.